to a brand new video today i just wanted to go over safe moon can i give you guys an update here on safe moon i feel like safe moon has just kind of fell off i mean as far as mainstream goes and as far as people being interested in these people talking about it obviously you know there's still people buying safe moon and trading safe moon you can see the the volume over the last 24 hours around 10 million so really i mean not that much trading volume going on here for safe moon but nonetheless, the market cap is still hovering at around over one billion, and it currently is on almost 1.6 million dollars. Sorry, it's currently on 1.6 million coin market cap users watch list. And if we take a look at the all-time Safe Moon chart here, we can see Safe Moon absolutely exploded in March, or actually, sorry, it absolutely exploded in April. It's we saw those all-time highs of Safe Moon around. 420 but we also saw a lot of other cryptos just really booming around that time and then a lot of people bought in at the dip and then it spiked back up again here in the middle of may kind of the same time when dogecoin started to absolutely go crazy and then you can see it has really just fallen off and has just had complete consolidation in price for honestly since the middle end of july heading into the new year heading into quarter four i mean it's really been the same price so I just wanted to kind of go over SafeMoon. Um, if you're watching this video, you're probably well familiar with SafeMoon. Don't want to go too far into the project itself. I just wanted to update you guys and really uh, reference an article that I find very interesting. So let's get into it. So obviously SafeMoon, the fastest growing crypto community on earth. Huge, huge community. 2.6 million holders of SafeMoon. So obviously massive, massive interest here. Um, initially when SafeMoon first came about and SafeMoon again I will say that I think SafeMoon kind of set the trend for a lot of cryptos and a lot of uh, cryptos that we have or seeing now that are created um, just so many cryptos being created now in relation to or trying to mimic SafeMoon was originally doing obviously with the reflection 5% is reflected to all holders for passive income liquidity pool acquisition 5% is added to the liquidity pool and then also the burn wallet concept the burn wallet receives a portion of the reflections to never be seen again so a lot of people really I want to say they bit SafeMoon's swag they 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 copied SafeMoon to a degree we're seeing a lot of people do this now or a lot of projects do this now but I wanted to reference this article here um, this came out two days ago on FX Street and take what you you know want for like FX Street in the the articles that they do right but I just found this article super interesting whale buys 225 grand worth of safe moon as analysts turn bullish a new safe moon wallet update was pushed out last week the development team has up upgraded the wallet with new features safe moon's wallets beta testers considered easy to use for beginners recently the BNB direct buy feature was added as well Within 24 hours of its launch, the SafeMoon wallet ranked in the top 25 applications on the App Store. The dominance of the large wallet investors is less than 15%, which implies SafeMoon is accessible to retail tra traders, unlike Doge and SHIB. So you can see here, a community-driven DeFi token SafeMoon has recovered from the drop in price that followed the unsuccessful triple launch. Traders expected SafeMoon to deliver a wallet alongside iOS and Android compatible applications. SafeMoon it didn't actually happen i think a lot of people including myself were anticipating safe moon really being a very strong app on the iphone being able to use it being it having it be extremely extremely user friendly and compatible with iphone and android users and safe moon did in fact did not deliver on that promise so it revealed it hit a technical snag uh, launching all three products at once and since then safe moon has worked on its wallet app and launched it for beta testers so here's john caroni the ceo of safe moon he says beta testers they tweeted this out October 9th. Beta testers of the SafeMoon wallet should have the BNB direct buy button. I want to give a special thanks to the team for making sure this gets done. Hashtag SafeMoon is the evolution. I'll be at Silicon Slope Summit in Utah. So within 24 hours of the application's launched, it ranked 25 in the top 25 of the App Store. And further, as of October 13th, the SafeMoon's top 50 wallet, whale, whale wallet dominance dropped below 15%. Top 10 and top 25 wallets dominant, dominance has dropped below 20%. Although a large wallet investor bought 225 grand worth of SafeMoon, and analysts have turned bullish on the altcoin, despite a nearly 95% drop from its peak, SafeMoon is posting gains and recovering from an unsuccessful triple launch event. So super, I mean, honestly, where we're going here with SafeMoon, again, I'm not a financial advisor, this is not financial advice, but I do think kind of right now, a nice little entry point to get maybe a little bag of SafeMoon if you're not holding some already. 
um, a little bit up from this red i mean obviously down here at the end of september we saw it in the extreme red but climbing back up here but still at a very very low price considering to where safe moon was and i think analysts again i, uh, I can't agree with them I, i'm starting to see in a little bullish outlook here for safe moon it's been a long time coming we saw kind of shiba inu take the reins and dominate the market and really just dominate the headlines for so long but safe moon here has always been in the back end making the safe moon wallet creating things that i think are going to create value for safe moon in the long run so really you guys let me know in the comments below how you guys feel about this hit that subscribe button hit the notification bell drop a like on this video and as always have a great day